Hello, my name is Amanda Dawson. I'm a General Surgeon and I'm the Dean of the Central Coast Medical School, which is part of the Central Coast Local Health District. We have two acute hospitals at Gosford and Wyong. We are a health service where the opportunities are enormous. Central Coast Local Health District has a strategy for caring for the coast. There are five key areas that are part of this strategy. Caring for our patients by providing high quality care to the people of the Central Coast and you can be part of the team in an integrated fashion, both within the hospital and in the community. We have strong partnerships and will help you negotiate the complexities of the health system. Caring for our staff, you'll find that many of our staff, both junior and senior doctors, also came here as students and liked it so much that they stayed. There is a strong sense of camaraderie. Our VMO versus RMO games each year, our change overnights, where you'll find senior doctors working as interns for the night, so our juniors can go to the party. Caring for our community to ensure that the community of the Central Coast is healthy and vibrant. We have regular links on our website to local events that you can attend, such as outdoor activities and the student-led clinic in NADOT Week. As a medical school, we are strongly committed to working with our Indigenous community to close the gap. We also aim to help you as a member of our community to achieve a work-life balance. Caring for our resources, including our budget, our equipment and our infrastructure. We are currently investing $72.5 million in a new medical school, which will have state-of-the-art technology. Caring for the future. There are lots of exciting things going on on the coast, not just in buildings, but in research and education. And that's where you come in. The opportunities are immense. And rather than tell you about them, I thought we might show you. Our students are part of our future and we'd like to invite you to join us in caring for the coast. We asked our students and staff what they liked about living and studying on the Central Coast. I'm Ashe, I'm one of the residents at the hospital here, currently working in ICU and I do a lot of teaching with medical students. Um, I'm interested in surgery so I do a lot of teaching about different surgical topics um, and I help out with um, supervising students in the research as well. So Imagine's a study that started up last year. It's an international collaboration between multiple different hospitals We're in Australia as well as overseas, especially in Europe. And we started off by um, students and a lot of students are involved uh, around the world. So here we've got lots of different medical students who are involved, junior doctors, as well as more senior surgical trainees as well. So we work in different groups um, to be able to collect data, to be able to be part of this big multi-center trial, which is really exciting. So the actual IMAGINE study is looking at um, the post-operative management of ileus in our surgical patients. So it's a really important topic. Um, I'm wonderful to be a part of this research at such an early stage in all of our careers. The idea of getting involved in a study sounds really daunting and scary, but um, it's actually not as hard as it sounds. The IMAGINE study is a, an international study. Basically, it's getting us involved in research about um, ileus management. It's great because it involves everyone from um, surgeons to registrars to residents and up to the medical student level. So with the research that we actually do here, all the students who are involved do get authorship um, for their actual contribution, which is amazing. Um, to have that opportunity um, and getting authorship in medical school is really important to be able to get recognition in your future career. So we were here as students a couple of years ago and they had a teaching from some of the doctors here for us and we found that really valuable. This year it was an idea that we were trying to make it a bit more organised, give it a name. So PRAISE, which stands for Promoting Residents Active Involvement in Student Teaching. I think some of the benefits of PRAISE are that, you know, students get to choose what they learn, what they want help with, and the doctors have been there. And a lot of JMP students become doctors here, so they know exactly what they're going through, know exactly what was on the test, so that way they can really help future students get through it and prepare to be junior doctors. It's going really well. We've got a lot of students who wanted to be part of it and lots of doctors who wanted to teach. Hi, I'm Lee. I'm one of the RMOs here at Central Coast Hospital and I was elected to be put in charge of the STITCH program for this year. So STITCH is a surgical trainee initiated teaching program on the Central Coast and it mainly teaches fourth year medical students during their eight week surgical rotation. There are some topics that are very difficult to teach in a lecture based format. 
This is more classroom based and so we do a two hour session once a week for eight weeks covering topics that are difficult and where JMOs can provide a practical and more experienced view of the topic. I'm finding that the students really enjoy having a junior doctor's perspective because we're more approachable and we can give them our practical experience that's recent when it comes to dealing with each of these topics. And all of the topics that we teach in this are things that will be examined in fourth year, especially during surgical vivas, but they are things that every junior doctor also has to deal with. So I wanted to try, see what it was like as a student here before I considered it for internship, but I'm really enjoying it, so it's, it's probably my first preference at the moment. My team has been amazing. Like I don't have to worry about getting anything sorted, any experience in anything, they really treat me like part of the team and I've got to do quite a lot of things. Outside of medicine is just really a great place to live. It's got everything Sydney has, but better, honestly, and cheaper. <laughs> um, I think that uh, Gosford Hospital is the perfect size hospital for a student because we get the same, uh, we get all range of presentations, um, but at the same time, it's not so hectic that we get forgotten as students and we can actually um, participate in procedures. I was able to attend all of the surgeries um, and I was really surgically inclined at the time. Um, and I was given the opportunity to do the vein stripping as well as the avulsion for a DVT. And I did all of that and the surgery was just by the side. Yeah, for me Gosford's kind of like that perfect blend between like a rural hospital and then a big city one in the sense that it's it's got a lot of the, the presentations and stuff that you see, but um, it, it feels more like you know a lot more people, everyone's really friendly and really close and you get quite, quite close to your teams. And even with the teaching, we get a lot more teaching here than we would have. So I really enjoy that and I feel I got a chance to help out during one of the recesses on the ward and the stuff that we learned in simulation was literally invaluable in that scenario, so it was, it was really good. Yeah, I chose the Central Coast Medical School because it's, um, number one, I heard that there's a really good culture in the medical school. All the staff and all the um, consultants and the doctors are very nice and approachable. And then also just the lifestyle in general, like it's just so close to everything and it has everything here as well. So yeah, that's what drew me here. Yeah. We really enjoyed our time here as students and during that time we got to see what it was like as an intern. And uh, we found that the interns here really enjoyed their time here and so you know, it was quite an easy step to, to want to do that as well here on the Central Coast. I had a great time studying at the Central Coast Medical School. I found it really well supported. The groups were nice and small and you had lots of clinicians, lots of people you could talk to. Yeah, I loved it. Everyone was really lovely, supportive, had excellent teaching. Couldn't recommend it more. You've seen a glimpse of what we can offer, but there is so much more. Both hospitals are undergoing major redevelopment and our facilities will have cutting edge technology. A health and wellness precinct will include our new medical school along with a medical research institute. We are a not too big but not too small urban hospital where students have opportunities to be part of a small group or one-on-one -on -one training with good exposure to acute and chronic diseases. We are very busy. We have over 120,000 admissions to our emergency department each year, more than 25,000 operations and service a community of over 350,000 people. As you have seen, we are well equipped to assist with your research projects, whatever they may be. We're experienced in running clinical trials and clinical research, and we're happy to innovate to provide education and development opportunities. The Central Coast has beautiful beaches and a friendly community. Our clinicians and lecturers are welcoming. Our staff are here to support you. We love living and working here. As your clinical dean, I give you my commitment and my promise that I will help to support you and that you will be well educated, well supervised and well cared for. I'm excited about our future and I'm excited about your future. So will you come and join us on the Central Coast?